Well, to South Pasadena now, where a national night out of it backfired. A police dog bit a little boy, leaving him injured and bloody. But now the police department is under fire. And tonight, the boy's father is talking to us. But South Pasadena police are not. KKL 9's Jake Reiner has details and reaction. A national night out, an evening intended to endear the public to police, had the opposite effect on the Forbes family. Like, I like an apology. Josh Forbes' five-year-old son, Sebastian, was enamored with the canine South Pasadena police had brought out to show off to the crowd. Sebastian took a few steps forward and then retreated, but all of a sudden, seemingly unprovoked. And before I could even get a chance to step back in the line, the dog went for me. Somehow he... He, he, locked, he locked eyes on Sebastian. He didn't like the look of him or something. And the dog just went straight for him and jumped on his face and was biting him and had him pinned to the ground. Josh and the canine's handler were able to pull the dog off Sebastian fairly quickly. And paramedics who were already on scene for the event tended to Sebastian in the ambulance. <laughs> there was like blood streaming down his head and it was, it was pretty scary. Sebastian was then rushed to the hospital. He he had a bite mark on his ear and needed stitches near his eye. The cut was so close to his eye they had to, to give him ketamine to put him under. According to Josh, he hasn't received much of anything in the way of remorse or an explanation from police other than a call from them Wednesday asking how Sebastian was doing. Josh says there has been no apology nor an admission of guilt. I was told, hey, you know, this is an accident. Accidents happen. Calm down. Yeah, I just want to make sure it doesn't happen again. I just want to make sure that that this is the last kid that that dog ever bites. Josh Forbes adds that if that bite had been any closer to his son's eye, he may have lost it. Now, we've been reaching out to South Pasadena police all day long, but have yet to hear back. In South Pasadena, I'm Jake Reiner, KCAL 9 News.